taxation and British oppression. Today really isn't an average Saturday in Ashurst Wood. For the first 1999 years of history, Ashurst Wood in East Sussex was just an ordinary English country village. But then there was a meeting, and the People's Republic of Ashurst Wood, a nation state, or prawns for short, was declared. Well, the risk of cracking is very bad, Joe. They don't all think you're prawn crackers, then. Really. Oh, they do, and we are. In fact, it's a prerequisite that we are crackers. Mad and bonkers, and that's great. It's the norm in Ashurst Wood. Now there are border checks to make sure no one enters or leaves the village without the correct paperwork. A Ministry of Propaganda which doubles as the post office where you can buy your prawns passport. And there are two ministries for mental health which seem among the most popular places to visit. We have had to uh, um, admit a lot of people into the Ministry of Mental Health um, because a lot of the local prawns have gone crackers. Most of the two and a half thousand citizens not directly involved in the government of prawns seem to be strong supporters of the new administration. I've been away over Christmas and I've come and I haven't got a clue what's going on and I think they're all gone balmy. It's probably something to do with uh, trying to get over the post millennium blues, you see. So maybe it will last, maybe it's something that will just disappear. Well, I think I never I'm going to. Well, I'm going to. 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 I'm going